What's up guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a cozy game alert for you guys and it is on the game called Critter Cove. I did play the demo for this game and I loved the demo. I'm really hoping that the save file crosses over. They did say it does, but you never know. There could be corruption. They mentioned that there's going to be a few more islands added towards this early access as well as more quests and things to do and more underwater stuff to explore. So I'm excited. Since I played the demo, I did already do my character creation. I went through all that. So of course I'm gonna show you guys my character and explain a little bit of what I've been up to since the demo. So let's just get right into it. All right, so this is my character. I decided to go with a mer person. This is what I look like. Oh, actually, let me take off my hat so you can see my top so this is what I look like I got some sweet black horns going on that little lighting thingy that I think angler fishes have I went with that on the top of course I have my mermaid looking tail as well some spikes on the back um, I think you start off with shoes but I prefer to have this character barefoot because they look kind of weird with shoes now let's see if we can Proceed with our activities today. Hey, Copper Bottom. What's up? I wish the sand wasn't so yellow. Oh my god, everybody's saying hi to me. Hello? <laughs> Usually when they say hi, they have something for you to do. Yeah. Excuse me. Oh, I have the in-game voices on, so that's what they sound like. Shout about clothing items. Do they want us to make the, the clothing shop next? Place a new loom. I found two, actually. Two old looms. Looms? A loom for all seasons. What do you want, Pokey? Oh, you found a key? Like, to treasure? Oh, it's got a skull on it! A master key. I don't know what it opens. Oh shit, see you later. <laughs> see you later, Pokey. Oh, let me go see if Sammy's, if Sammy's at his job. Is the boat still here? Yes, the tourist boat is still here. So I put Sammy um, to work at the cafe. Let me go see if he's there. Is that him? Hello? Look at him! He's so cute! Oh, more people are eating! Hello? I didn't see this person here last time. This is amazing! Is this a popcorn stand? Let me just get rid of that. Research. Pop on by popcorn stand. One of 25. I don't remember that being there the last time I played. Girl, you okay? Um, so yeah, I put Sammy as working in the cafe. Um, I was expecting him to be a little like, me, why me? I'm not the right fit. Because he's a little timid of things sometimes. But he said he'd always wanted to be in a cafe, so I guess it worked out. Um, why does this one look like he's sitting but what walking? Hello? That doesn't look right. Okay. Hey, Sammy! I got a special order that I need taken out to Rick's outpost. Oh. Wait, what? I guess I'm delivering now? Rig's lunch order. Well, I gotta wait for that stuff to be made anyways. Where is this at though? Where are we going? Oh. Now we can go to the rig. I was going that way in the demo and I was denied. This gives me CFB vibes when you see stuff in the water. And you're like, there's treasure! <laughs> and you just dive in and try to grab it. You never know what you might find. Ooh, he's got little Christmas lights. Where do I park? Here? Does it matter? Oh, I barely made it, Jesus. Wait. Did I 
Did I? Okay. I think we're good. What's this? Oh, chop. Uh, I think I saw someone walk up. Oh. Hello? Riggs O'Malley! Here you go. Here's your lunch. My lunch! Aw, oh, what do you want me to do? I got this set of stairs in the back? Oh. Sure. Those stairs? Um... Yeah, those are totally broken. Tourists leaving. You earned 115. Ooh. Show tourism. Is that new? It is new. This wasn't here before. Worker accidents. Uh, the cafe made 100 coin. I assume somebody tipped 15. Oh, he needs a metal pipe and a motor and what? A gear? I don't think I have a motor on me. Darn it. Alright, well, I need to come back and bring this stuff to fix that guy's stairs. Uh, now we're gonna go to... Oh, the lighthouse is so bright. Bernard's Quest. that dig oh I found marble uh hello what the hell barnacle a little octopus dude what's up yeah, I don't have a fishing rod. Never mind that. It's an epic battle between octopus and fish. I can give you instructions how to make your own po poli polina? Polina. Okay. I'm gonna make fishing pole. When you got your pole made, come back and... Oh. Uh... Can I make it here, or do I have to go back? Basic fishing bowl. I forgot there was fishing in this game. I wonder if there's bug catching, because... There's like, specific areas with bugs. Oh, I can't make it here. Dang it, I don't have those parts. Time to give Renard his ugly green egg. Oh, he's not even open yet. Um, uh, where is he? Oh, look, look at Sammy. He went he went right from his house to the cafe. <laughs> he's all ready to work. Oh, now he's open. Okay. I have your werewolf. A delicacy. What did I get? Learn green eggs and scram. <laughs> green eggs and scram. That's funny. There's barnacle. Oh, shit. That's a lot of fish, too. I did it. I did it. Would you look at that pole? We need to test her out. How about catch me five gupper? Uh, okay. So, let's see how this works. How do I use it? Do they actually swim to? Oh my god, look at that big. Look at that big shadow! That's huge! Do I just like pull back when it bites? Let's try it again. I see a shadow. A 
huge shadow. Okay. Uh, what did I get? A squidlet? Oh my god, it's so tiny. Here you go, sir. I have the guppers. Look at these beautiful fish. You've made this old fisherman proud. I feel like I should teach you something else. Fish racks are stylish and bring just the right odor to any fish village. Okay. We can make a fish rack now. You don't want to come to my island, though? Oh, you got a peg leg. Fish rack. Nice. Why couldn't I have a peg leg when I was making my character? I'm back. Let's see what it needs. Oh, I forgot the motor. Dang it. We got the gear. Oh. Um. The pipe. Just the motor? Replace simple motor. Alright, let me go get the motor really quick. Alright, I have the motor. Hopefully it's just one. Replace. There we go. Ta-da! Now what's up there? What is this? Ooh, golden eggs. Did I get a golden egg? Yeah. Excuse me. I did get a golden egg. Can we sell it? Who laid a golden egg though? Two of 20 balloon guards. I can't grab these eggs. Give to museum. <gasps> There's a museum in the game. Oh, I don't know if you guys can see, yeah. excuse me, the gr grid on the map, kind of? There wasn't a grid there last time. This is a huge map, even though it's not totally full, but still, I wonder if we can go past to that way. Alright, per the map, it's somewhere right here, so... It's not letting me drop the anchor. And then we gotta put the dish on. Um, see, there's fish there, but it's not gonna let me fish. Because it's the same button to drive. Hooy! Which is a bummer. Go, oh my god. Why are there octopus? Why is there a house down here? What is this? The sunken manor. Why is there a house? And this house is huge! What's this? Hey, here's a fun and easy ice cream recipe I figured out. Just get a whole coconut and add sugar to it. BAM! Okay, can I take this? No? I guess not. Sugar and coconut. Replace blasting charge. Okay. Okay. Mm Does this lead back outside though? Uh, no. It leads to a room. Was not expecting to find a whole ass building <laughs> down here. Um, a little worried that there's tentacles on it. Are there any floors? Girl. Are there any other floors or windows we can? Creep into though. Oh, never mind. So maybe that one room. This makes me think of uh, that one show. Dismantle. Can I have this phone booth? Yes. Uh, 
whatever's in that room, though, better be some sweet loot. Considering it's in a locked room. What is this? Looks like a fridge. Oh, it's a cat. Oh, it's a vending machine. Okay. But yeah, definitely was not expecting a big, a big building to be here. Girl. They need to update the game where if there's nothing for you to dismantle, it shouldn't let you do this. You know how many times I thought I was actually dismantling something and I wasn't because they just kept doing it? Yeah. Can I dismantle this? I can pick it up. What's up there? What's this? Is that a stove? It is a stove. Nice. Garbage. Good thing we explored, Mira. We found a whole damn house. Let's see if there's anything else that I can creep into. These plants look a little creepy. Is there up, up here? Yes. Good thing we have three tanks. Is that treasure? Three tanks of air. Open. A, pi a pillar. We got a pillar. Does this go anywhere else? Oh, I was just here. We're going up. Take a look around. Oh! <gasps> what? I can open these doors? What is this? Armed Tidiness Assistant. A Roomba? Did I just get a Roomba? There's a lot of stuff in- oh. Um, you know what? <laughs> I was kind of surprised that they have skeletons. Read. Those annoying people are on the TV again. They just won't shut up. Wonky Network is still running fun shows. Did they just like sit here and just accept their death? I'm confused. My air tank is gonna run out. It should just automatically replace. There you go. See? If you're gonna do some ocean exploration, make sure you have multiple tanks. Especially exploring this house. <laughs> Knowing that we can open doors. So I think the only room we can't open is the locked one. This is a cool house though. It looks like it was meant to be underwater. I wonder what happened for... Can I go down here? No? It looks like I fit. Oh, I do! Um... Oh, it's a secret room. But something happened for them, for like the windows or whatever to have broken. I don't actually know if the part that I needed was in that building or if it's something that was up here. Unlocked beach chair. <gasps> I can make a blasting charge right now. Ooh, to open that door. Yes. Oh Lord Jesus. Please let me get out of the way. Oh, it's another duck! He's got a little hat on! Winston Featherton the third! Oh my god, I'm gonna collect all the ducks and fill my house with them. I guess uh, it was just that collectible. So, I guess I did pick up whatever he needed me to, because it's not marked on the map anymore. So I'm just going to explore the island, pick up some stuff, and then head back. What the hell? Hello? There's a chicken dude here! Is his eye... I was going to say, is his eye broken? Are you okay? What happened? Sure. This guy is 
trapped. How long has he been in here? Chop. There you go, buddy. Dang, thank god I looked around. <laughs> Can you imagine if I just left? Poor dude. Whew, that was honestly terrifying. Yeah, I can't imagine. Jesus. So take this. What is this? We got a wacky vest. Come to my island! Uh... Yeah, I gotta move my ship closer. My bad. There you go, the boat's closer. Get on the boat! Not a bad idea. Get in there! There you go. Alright, uh, I guess I'll just head back to the island. We have a new creature to join us. Hoi! Aw, oh, dang it, it's glitched. Back up. There you go. Okay, now where is the island from here? There's plenty of time to explore stuff, so I'm just gonna head back to the island so this guy can get situated. <laughs> Oh man, I would have felt so bad if I just left. We're here! Welcome. It's not much, but it looks more like trash heave cope to me. Yeah. You know what? We're just getting started, okay? I'm gonna need a tent. Can I, can I make him a tent right now? My pockets are full. Here's your tent, sir. Here you go. You actually did it! Yep. Ooh, what is that? <gasps> we have a skeleton! Alright, he's, he's gonna go somewhere to set up his tent. I think we have two villagers now that need a house. Now we can make this control panel, so let's do that. I assume it's used to upgrade our boat? Um, because it's on the dock, otherwise what else would it be used for? There's like a big magnet there too. Maybe they use that to pick up the boat to upgrade it? Bam! Okay, now we gotta talk to Anchor. Uh, it's closed. And it's gone. There he is. <laughs> See, I told you. Hello. I finished the repairs. Now you'll be able to add- oh, yeah, see, I knew it! You'll be able to add upgrades to your ship! Wait, so do I just go... to... the machine? Well, that is where I'm gonna end the gameplay here of Crater Cove. So I definitely love this game. I loved the demo and I couldn't wait for the early access version to come out. I am just a little worried that I might do everything a little too fast where I just end up not playing the rest of the game once they actually fully release it. That's the only downside about early access games, especially if they don't give you a lot of content in the early access version, is sometimes they kind of shoot themselves in the foot with early access because most people, when they do everything they've done in the early access version, whether they release updates, a lot of people just end up not playing the game anymore because it's kind of like, well, I kind of already got my full of the game. So I'm a little worried about that. I'm hoping that they release the full version pretty soon. I think they're supposed to have the full 1.0 version in 2025, which isn't that far away, but who knows. But I am definitely loving my time with Critter Cove, especially because it reminds me of the My Time games, My Time at Portia, My Time at Sandrock, which I definitely love both of those games as well. By the way, they are making another My Time game. I just found out uh, late last night when I was just going through Steam. So Critter Cove, yes. So the things I like about Critter Cove is, like I said, it's very similar to the My Time games as far as the crafting part of it, it doesn't feel like the basis of the game is farming. It feels more like it's based on crafting and exploration, which I love. I like seeing the designs of all the critters that you see come onto your island. I'm wondering if, if any of those critters are specific to like a dev that worked in the game. Like, this is so-and-so's critter, this is so-and-so's critter, that'd be hilarious if that was the case.
I think would be really cool. I don't think they're ever going to do this, but I think what would be cool is if they integrated some weird mechanic where if you were streaming the game, there was an option where whoever's watching your stream can be part of the visitors uh, or the tourists that go on your island. You know what I mean? Kind of like um, Garden Paws, where I think if you're playing online and if you open your shop, whoever is online and I think on the same server, like their name pops up when they're visiting your shop. It's not the actual like person playing the game going to your shop, but their character ends up going into your shop and you see the character they designed and all that stuff and you see their name above them. But I think they also have the option where if you're streaming the game, whoever's in your chat can end up being a character that goes in your shop and you see the person's name on top of them. It's pretty cool. It's pretty neat. So I think that'd be a really neat thing that they can add into the game if you ever have like the boat of tourists visit you and if you're streaming the game that whoever's in your chat or watching your stream ends up being one of the tourists that come out of the boat. It would obviously be a randomized like character generated for them but just to see their name above that specific character I think would be so cool. There's not a lot of stuff that I don't like about the game but again it is an early access. Uh, there are a few glitches that I noticed. One of them being the glitch with your boat when you're trying to I was gonna say dismantle when you're trying to park your boat and get out that's very glitchy I do wish that we were able to fish out of our boat because a big a big portion if not almost the whole portion of the map is just water it's just the ocean so I feel like we should be allowed to travel around and just fish in different fishing spots on the ocean I don't know if that's a thing I feel like it should be, but again, the whole trying to fish out of your boat is very glitchy and also trying to just like drop the anchor or stop your boat is really glitchy. Like stopping and starting it is glitchy when you're already out in the ocean. There are also some instances where it glitches when you're getting onto your boat from the dock. I don't know if this was just a thing in the demo or maybe just certain quests, but in the demo when there was a quest where you had to build something or make something if you look on your quest list and you hover over that specific quest it'll show you on the uh, right side on the bottom like what you're still missing or what you need to build whatever item and in the early access version or at least with the first few quests that I ended up getting in the early access version it doesn't show that so I feel like that would be a bit annoying because like I'm not gonna remember the five or ten things that I need to build something if I'm off exploring or if I get distracted and then I have to go all the way back just to look at it again or I have to take a picture of it with my phone like mm -mm. the other thing that I feel they need to work on is like I mentioned earlier in the playthrough when for example something that that can be dismantled right it would pop up dismantle and you're pressing the button down once it's dismantled it should just stop the action but it doesn't, it keeps going. So you could be there dismantling something for like, I don't know, a minute after it's been dismantled and you don't know because you can't really see the item based on the angles of the camera or if you're in a tight spot, you know what I mean? So stuff like that I feel like should be fixed, especially if you are running out of air and you don't know if you're done dismantling something. So that can get pretty annoying pretty quickly. I think that's pretty much it as far as the cons or glitches that I found in the game. It's not a lot, but it's still some things that they do have to work on and they have time to because it is early access. I'm excited to see the other islands and also what other islands they might add because if you look at the map, there's a, like, there's a big enough space surrounding the area that hasn't been touched yet. And you can see up to a certain point where they put little drawings or something. So I'm curious to see how many more islands they're going to add in total before the full release. If you stuck to this part of the video, add the fishing rod emoji in the comments. That way I know. And I'd very much appreciate it because it lets me know you watched the whole video. Don't forget to like the video as it helps me out a lot. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!